we're gonna go up, we're gonna make a fire. I think. Some very nice wool uh, sweaters. Oh yeah. It's always comforting to see scratching posts. This. Ooh, the moss has grown into it. I cut this down with a stone axe. Oh goodness, I don't know how long ago. A couple years ago. I just put moss on top just to not draw attention to it. Sounds like it's saying oink, oink, oink. I think it's a pig crow. Man, it is really wet in this area. Everything's just soaked. It hasn't even rained forever. I think it's just the dew. What should we do? What should we do? Go back to that leaning tree right there. Go back to the flat part. Go back to the Go back home. Back home? No. You crazy. Yeah, but that's not the whole point. I mean, you can wrap yourself up in a blanket and never leave your house either. That'd be kind of crazy. You gotta get out and enjoy life and have adventures. Huh? Yeah. yeah. Can you fit in there? I would be careful with spider webs. Oh, well, it's not the webs you gotta worry about. It's the spiders. It's the spiders. Yeah. <laughs> What do we do now? We gotta start a fire. What do we do? First, first collect firewood. Well, where Find are we gonna get firewood stump. from? Find oh, a rotten stump. Uh, 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 rotten like stump? That. I know. Like that. Pitch stump. wood. Pitch wood. Yeah, find pitch wood out of a Kay. rotten stump. Go get pitch wood out of that rotten stump. I can see it. I can see it. I thought I was just telling him that we'd be. You guys are mean. Oh, you're right. Okay, we don't need to tear the whole stump apart. There's a lot of critters that live in this stump through the winter. But you see these pieces sticking out the top? Oh, that is solid. Look at that. There's a metal one. That's pitchwood. Yep, we can grab this. Let's grab this one right here. It's closest. Whoa. Whoa! <laughs> Good thing you got that on camera. Don't ever say that on a video. That ruins a video. Oh, I'm on camera! Oh, I got it on video! Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Makes a good video really stupid. Look at Let's get a close-up of that. Shall we? It's beautiful and sticky. I like it. Ew! I've eaten. I've <laughs> licked pitch before. I've actually yeah. scared that. I've actually it ate. looks good to eat. I've actually <laughs> ate pitch before. I believe it. Oh yeah. Now watch this. I got my lighter going. Oh, whoa! Hi. <laughs> This soaking wet forest. We now have fire instantly. It almost died. I brought my flint and steel today. It's our firewood bark. Thick, heavy, old growth bark from the tree that fell down. Um, you're catching on fire there. That bark is burning hot. It works really good. And we have plenty more on that stump back there. So, what have we learned today about fire making in a sopping wet rainforest? You find a... Uh, you find a... Oh, 
rotten stump, and oh. then you look for hard pitch wood, and make sure to bring your lighter. Your lighter, yeah. Well, but what do you do once the pitch wood's going? You get you get wet things, or you put it down, or you find bark. What do you mean wet things? Like wet sticks, or you find bark. But wet wet of, sticks of, don't burn, do they? You find bark. Wet. Well, let's go, let's go back to the wet sticks. What about the wet sticks? That you put. How did we get this fire going? By bark. We collected a whole bunch of pitch. pitch, and then bark. You bark at it like. Wah, 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 no, wah. We got That's not going to get no pitch. fire going. Only we lit the <laughs> fire so the pitch so it was big, and then after the fire was pretty big and it going, then we went and got the wet sticks. We laid the wet sticks on and the bark, and then. It Why the wet sticks? Because then so cause it's dry. so wet and there's nothing up. What? No so they can dry. Very yeah. good. But then we found that nice supply of of bark from that old growth tree that fell over. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> it's burning. So that worked really good. And it stayed burning. It stayed burning for a long time. Uh, this is really nice. Other than it's pitch black and we've got to ride our bikes back home. Yeah. Once we get get across the creek through the forest. Let's start heading home because it's a steep. Why? Place. Yeah. Because it's getting dark. We, we, we all have, all have flashlights. No. I'm like riding my bike home in the dark. Who has flashlights? I do. Me. It's right here. I have a flashlight. I was looking. That means that that we can run and leave some of you behind. That's really. Wee. Okay. Since it's now dark, and we only have a couple flashlights, and just because it'd be fun, we're gonna make a torch. There is a pitchwood stump right over behind Ready? you guys. Oh yeah, that's solid. So we want some longer pieces here. That's some good pitchwood there. See? Now, we're going to take these pieces and the cordage that you gave me, and we're going to tie these on. There we go. We'll tie this up like this. And since this is is uh, we're going to have to not let the flames get down to this cord since um, it will burn. Duh. Here, just to finish it off. Okay, and there's our basic holder. Because you don't want the flames getting down too far. Otherwise they'll burn your cordage. Ouch. Okay. And then we'll just stick this in the fire here to get it going. Just the end. You don't want the whole thing burning. Okay, well that's going. We're gonna bring some pieces to keep feeding it as we walk along because it will eventually burn up. So. Oh, that'd be perfect. <laughs> that hurt. <laughs> That's some really nice pitch wood. Okay, so we will use, this will be our, oh! I thought my, my thing's on fire. <laughs> okay. Micah. There we go. Okay, you got your stuff? Yep. Okay. Hi. Got our torch. That's pretty good. You definitely don't want to put this over your head because it will start dripping. Alright, let's do it. I hope I don't trip and fall and land on my...
Yeah. You guys see all right? Yeah. yeah. We need to go back this way. You know what's funny? Is I've been up here a hundred times, but in the dark here, I got turned around and we're coming down not where I thought we were coming. Yeah, you definitely don't want to do this in the summertime. We're kind of leaving a trail of sparks and burning debris. Okay, now we're getting where we're supposed to be. <laughs> okay, we're going to have to go down this hill here, so goodbye. Oh, look at there's a dead man's bone right there. It's a human bone. Yeah, I think because so many people have gotten lost in this forest that uh, they've just gotten lost and died. That wasn't a human bone. Whatever. Oh, how's that? Okay, we're trying to get this, our new sticks alight. And it's working. Your thing was way different than mine. Of this thing. Can you make it? <laughs> Oh, and my pieces just fell out in the water. Our little bridge we made. Good. Sounds good. Okay. Um, that's strange. Hey, this look, there's our bikes. Nice, we made it. Now we gotta just go back in the in the dark. Maybe we'll try it with our with the torch. <laughs> well, I think our torch worked really good. And uh, we had it going, what, probably about half an hour? Probably. Yeah. So, and I still have my cordage. I didn't burn my cordage up. Ah. All right, I'm going to have to pedal my bike. So, thanks for coming along.